Hello, thanks for joining me in our collection of books called Sitting Under Trees Reading Books. And today we're going to read A Tree is Nice by Janice May Adri with pictures by Mark Simont. And we're sitting under this old character and kind of a cluster of other trees around it. So let's have a seat and I hope you enjoy this book with me. A Tree is Nice. birds are singing. It's a beautiful day. I bet the trees are thinking, or the birds are thinking trees are nice too. Trees are very nice. They fill up the sky. They go beside the rivers and down the valleys. They live up on the hills. Trees make the woods. They make everything beautiful. Even if you have just one tree, it is nice too. A tree is nice because it has leaves. The leaves whisper in the breeze all summer long. In the fall, the leaves come down and we play in them. We walk in the leaves and roll in the leaves. We build playhouses out of leaves. Then we pile them up with our rakes and have a bonfire. But only do that on days when it's allowed and when you have a permit, right? Yeah, right. A tree is nice because it has a trunk and limbs. We can climb the tree and see over all the yards. We can sit on a limb and think about things or play pirate ship up in the tree. That is a huge tree. I'm not sure they would have actually been able to climb that tree the way they did. A smaller tree is probably a better choice, don't you think? But it looks like fun. If it is an apple tree, we can climb it to pick the apples. Yum. Cats get away from dogs by going up the tree. Birds build nests in trees and live there. Sticks come off the trees too. We draw in the sand with sticks. Very nice drawings. Can you hear that robin singing? I hope you can. It's like it's reading the book with us. A tree is nice to hang a swing in or a basket of flowers. It is a good place to lean your hoe while you rest. Oh, they're planting a garden. Look at that. I hope that's something you can do this year too. A tree is nice because it makes shade. The cows lie down in the shade when it is hot. I bet you've seen that. Driving past herds of cattle, finding shade under trees. People have picnics there too. And the baby takes his nap in his buggy in the shade. <laughs> a lot of people napping, not just the baby. A tree is nice for a house to be near. The tree shades the house and keeps it cool. The tree holds off the wind and keeps the wind from blowing the roof off the house sometimes. Oh dear. I guess in Nebraska, you never know what the wind might do. A tree is nice. You dig the biggest hole you can and put the little tree in. Then you pour in lots of water and then the dirt. You hang the shovel back in the garage. Every day for years and years, you watch the little tree grow. You say to people, I planted that tree. Oh dear. Sorry. The suspense. They wish they had one. So they go home and plant a tree too. A tree is nice. I hope you enjoyed that book today in our collection of stories called Sitting Under Trees Reading Books. We're here at Prairie Loft in Hastings, Nebraska. It's a lovely day and I have enjoyed reading this book with you. I hope I see you next time and I hope you find a tree and read a book today. Thanks for joining me. See you soon.